Hello, community! Today I got a new tip for you, and it's revolving around layering. Now, I'm not effing here to tell you to layer your sounds, because it can make for much richer and fuller sound, and you should do that. Try to stack kick on top of kick on top of kick on top of kick. Don't overdo it. Relax. Just two or three. What I am here, however, to do here is uh, give you an easier way to work with layering sounds. So here's what I have here. Sounds good, but it sounds too weak. Not only weak, but it sounds like it's pathetic. Of course, this is going to depend on what kind of packages you use and what kind of sounds come from those packages that you decide to use. Most of the time, you need to layer your sounds. So instead of using just one kick, use two of them. Throughout making your music, you might decide to add another kick or another snare on top. You might want to change something. But if you decide to do that, then you will have to go in and program each of these once again for the new sound that you implement into your project. That can be a tedious process. How to simplify this? After you play your pathetic drum beat, you add more sounds to it, you layer something. Now there's more going on, but if I keep adding more, it's gonna become tedious to keep programming each one. So what do you do? You link them all together in one layer. It's, it's funny that you can just click plus, and since you, we are layering sounds, we can use a little thingy over here. It's called layer, you click that. And this little thing is gonna open up. And I love these guys from ImageLine, they really think of us. Look at this, how convenient this is. Under layering, you can set children and show children. First things first, you do, you select a couple of layers by or sounds. By simply clicking and dragging, you can hold shift and click on another one, another one. And that's how you select another one if you want to. See these little things, that's, if they light up green, that's when you know it's something is selected. So now that we have selected both of the kicks, I'm gonna click set children. And what this is gonna do now, if I select this layer, it plays both of the sounds at the same time. So now instead of me programming each and one of these, I can just program this one. And of course, uh, re rename it, where, there you go, rename it, kick, put a color, and that's it, look at that. Every time I, I add a new kick, I'm just going to make sure I link it to this particular layer. So anyhow, you get it, smart crew, much love. Now of course, if there's some separate kick you want to add and you want to program it differently, you don't have to link it. But since you will, will be layering a lot of the sounds, it's gonna be super useful to just link all of them. And if you click show children, it's gonna select both of these automatically. Here's what you can then do if you add another kick. Let's say I add this one. What I can do is click show children, hold shift, and just click again and click set children. Now, again, this kick has been added to the link. It's been added to the layer. See? That's how easy it is. Look at that. That's a beauty right there. Ugh, I freaking love these guys from Image Line. They're so awesome. I bet some of those asses look at these tutorials and think to themselves, hmm, this guy makes a good point. I should add that to the program. Awesome. I love it. Much love. Anyhow, here's some food for thought before I go. I'll give you, a, I guess, an analogy and you can use it for some other field in life. YouTube had a star rating where you could grade the video one to five stars. Now it's just like and dislike. I don't think it's the same if I uh, dislike a video from Justin Bieber and say, for example, Hitler. It's not all that black and white world, come on. Not everything is evil. It's a matter of perspective. What do you think? Thanks for tuning in to this video. Uh, what a mythical guy. Jesus, what the hell he just said? Well, it's up to you to interpret that shit any way you want to. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more, and I'll see you soon. Peace.